guys. Okay, welcome back. It's me, Sarita, Mrs. B Lux, LVOE, and welcome back. We're going to talk about these two totes. I know some people are venturing into luxury, venturing into designer handbags, venturing into, I guess, a, another level of handbags. So these are two options for totes and we'll go over the comparison with them. It's up to you on which one you choose, but this is just so you can see the difference with each one comes with a little gift. <laughs> I call it a gift, but it's really a piece of the bag and exactly like the differences of the two. They're both two different, totally different price points. This one some years ago was, I think like 550 for this size. And now it is, well, this is the Liz Tote by MCM. It's $695. It is, it's coated canvas. Well, they call this their monogram also. So this is the MCM monogram coated canvas and Napa leather trim. So all of this, I'll move this one, is tr leather trim, Napa leather trim. All of the trim, everything. This one comes with a bonus clutch. Goes on the shoulder, just like that. Easy in, easy out. The difference with this clutch, it can be used as a, a handbag. So it's like two bags in one with the MCM. It's also reversible. This is the new, we got this one last year. And I say we because this is my daughter's tote. She just had to have an MCM tote, even though she has a never for the same exact one with her initials hot stamped on it but she wanted the MCM tote. So I was like, let me do a review for you guys with the bag that I bought for her. <laughs> Just like it's mine, cause I paid for it. So this one has the new interior. Some may have the older interior, but if y'all can see, that's how it is. It's supposed to be reversible, but to each their own. This one's gonna stay with the coated canvas showing. So I think that's gunmetal, let me see. Yeah, it's dark cobalt metal hardware. So you can see the hardware on there, on the sides. Yeah, so it's a nice bag, shoulder wise. That's it. So it's a good, it's a good tote. The straps stay on, boom. You can cinch the sides in. Only on one side is the D ring. Let it look like this, huh? Making sure. And now that's it as a smaller tote, I guess. Did I do that right? <laughs> Trying to make sure. But yeah. I think we punch it in. I don't know. It didn't come out right. I might have did it wrong. Hold on, y'all. with it as you can see oh it's a d-ring on this side too so so there's one outside and inside why i don't know but okay that's that's how it is so but dimension wise this one is showing as i had it on here 6.7 by 14.2 by 11 inches so for the narrow full, if I'm not mistaken, they're almost the same. This one's 12.6 by 11.4 by 6.7. So they're wooden, wooden size, but standing up, this one's only probably like an inch, if that taller, an inch, if that. So now let's do the Neverfull. As we all know, this is coated canvas. 
treated leather trim. The straps on this one are shorter than on the MCM. But shoulder wise, it is a little get on there, but that's it on the shoulder. Let me stand back. That's the shoulder bag. And this one comes with a pouch. It's not like that one. It's only a wristlet style. Size wise, let's see. Well, as y'all can see, the Neverfull pouch is way smaller than the MCM one, but it's also just a wristlet. This is like a second little handbag, like a shoulder bag. If you just want to throw some stuff in and go in this roomy too. Let me show y'all, I should have stopped. Hold on, let's pretend we're still on the MCM. It's roomy, well somebody has some jingle jingle in there, but it's roomy. I'm gonna see, this is what I'm carrying. This is what I'm carrying currently, and I'm going to try the silver wallet in here. Damn, that's just with the silver wallet in it. Perfect, full size, and it's only full to here, so you have all this you can still fill it up with. So, let me show you. Yeah, so it's very roomy. And that's a full size wallet. So, like I said, the handbag or the, what they call it, the insert. I don't know what they call it. I think they call it a pouch. Yeah, it's a removable zip pouch. That's what they call that. So, that is the medium Liz tote by MCM. Now, let's move her, I guess, right here. Then we go back to Miss Neverfull. MM and I'm your baby. Like I said, I'll put that in there. Coated canvas and Damia Bean print. Hot stamps on the treated leather. I don't know, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm obsessed with hot stamping. So anything I buy, if it can be hot stamp, stamp it please. We had an issue with the Speedy getting hot stamp, but I wanted hot stamp. If it can't be hot stamp, personalize it for me please. But as you can see, just like the Liz tote, they both have the pull strings on the side, I guess. Adjustable strings. The MCM one is about as long, just has a D-ring. So, tote-wise, let me show y'all the bottom. This one is a little longer, so I guess it's 14 longer. Because length-wise, it's longer. Width-wise, they're about the same. Height-wise, it looks like about an inch. If that, probably a, a little bit under an inch. But the inside of this one is cherry red. Beautiful, beautiful. If you have Damia Bean, I know some like, what is it, the ballerina pink? I think it's ballerina pink. Yeah, my, my god sister, she has hers with ballerina pink in it, but I like the red. Oh, uh, does she have the red? I don't know, she watching, so she gonna comment. But I think she has the pink or she wanted the pink. It's one or the other. She either has the pink, that light cotton candy pink, which I think they call it ballerina, or she wanted, she wanted or she has it. So it's one or the other. But I wanted it in cherry. It's to me, it's the original. And I like having the original. It's classic. So the MM size for me is um travel good, daily good, going to work good, just to have good. So don't have to have a special reason to have a handbag, but some do, and to each their own. I believe in that. If you can do it, do it. If you can't, wait your time. Anybody can own any of these bags, save. It doesn't hurt to save. We all want a lot of things in life. Save. Save for it, and then at the end, once you buy it, it feels a little better and a little honorable to have it. So I told y'all on another video, I was going to tell y'all how to travel and buy bags and mix them both like buying your bags will end up having you traveling for pennies on the dollars i have not forgotten i'm going to get to the video i just have to do it i have to sit down and literally do it but once i tell y'all y'all gonna be like because honey credit is your best friend savings is your best friend they both go hand in hand but some people are like, oh, I don't like buying that because that's so expensive. When you're buying this and it's paying for a trip, it's a plus. So 
that's all I'm just gonna do today. Oh, hold on, we have someone at the door. Here's some MCM history. You can pause it to read it. They came out in 1976. They, each bag has its own unique registration number. And a couple of pictures of me trying on some of the bags. Now here's the Neverfull GM cinched in and regular. And then the Neverfull MM cinched in and regular. Below I'll have an article about the history of the Neverfull. Okay, I'm back. Y'all see what this is? This was the ding dong at the door. Y'all see that? We all know what that box means. But we can't open it yet. Somebody's birthday is coming. And that unboxing is for that day. So when that day comes, we're gonna unbox that gift. So like I was saying, we do a comparison with these totes. If I had to choose, which a couple years ago I wanted the red one. They had a red in this one. I tried it on and everything. I may still have the picture. Tried it on the Nordstroms about probably five or six years ago, but I didn't get it. Now that one that they had, it was red with the black stamping. They don't make it anymore. I think it's navy blue now, but I wanted the red. So wah wah wah. But my choice is the Neverfull. I love the Neverfull, but I will still get an MCM. If I can get the right one. I don't want a black one. I keep thinking about that Kanye color, but I'm not sure. So, I don't know. By the end of the year, I might buy one. And really just because of the history of MCM, that Kanye one is the one that would be top of my list just to have it. Years down the line, it might be the same price as, because we know where this one started. In 2008, my sister bought the Monogram GM Neverfull, $811 out the door after tax. Baby, that bag is over $2,000 now. I think it's $2,100. I think it's $2,100, but that says a lot. So if I can go ahead and get this one now, and in 10 years, if it's over $2,000, I'll feel good about it at the price. So, and on MCM's website, when it's your first purchase, you get either 10 or 15% off. That was a plus. We're not doing that over here though. Unless you buy it from Fashion File, Rebag, or something like that, there's no discount unless you work there. If you're an employee there, or your spouse works there, maybe. But other than that, you paying regular price just like me. You may be saving tax in certain states, but regular price plus tax. And I think by the end of the year, this bag is gonna be close to 2,500. That's just me saying that this is what? March 7th, 2023. Y'all remember, if I said it, 25, I could see it all day, 2,300. I can see it, I can see it. So it's not gonna stop anyone from buying it, I bet you that, but I can see it at that price. So would it be worth it? Is it worth what it's priced at now? I don't think so, I don't think so. I personally wouldn't even buy it at the price that it is now. So I don't know, I don't know. These increases are a thing of their own, but today was just about the totes and I'm not gonna be long-winded like I always am. I hope you guys are having a great day. Great, oh, there's the bell again. Yes, somebody's always here. I think it's my sister. She's a Louis girl too. Don't you okay. Know. I hate it, but I don't know. Okay. Cause remember my things start rolling up mm -hmm. on the side, yeah. But this is this one. What is this? This is treated leather. So if you aren't sure what the treated leather is, this is the Vachetta, non-treated, all natural. And it's really, really what, banana? Like banana white when you when get you it? First get it, yeah, it's real light. It's as long as it's not been returned and somebody brought it back and you, you know, but we're not gonna talk about that. But when you get it brand new from the boutique or online client services, it's like a banana white. Mm -hmm. After a couple years, it starts getting this beautiful treated look, but it's what? Patina from the Earl, oil. the natural Earl. Oh, from you say it. What? Tell them. Oh. <laughs> From the patina of just your hands, your sweat, and life. Oh, Look, that's life on the bag. I personally prefer natural, untreated. What is the new one called? What? The one they sell them and they already dark. Oh, I don't know. The treated vachetta. I don't like. I, it's okay. What does it mean treated? It means it's it's already no, it's not no no pre love. But they it's have it darker, darker already. Oh, no, I don't want that. Me neither. I, I like it to have so. my life. 
story. Yeah. That's what I call this, a life story. She's, so, yeah, she was everything big. Back bag, bottle yeah, bag, diaper bag. bag. Life. That was everything big. Spoken to my mother. World. She made a trip Disney. to Disney World. She's been by the coastal <laughs> already. But yes. Both of these are MMs. She also has a GM, but as y'all can see, stand by me. What? I'm the shorter She's sister. Over. She's tall. And I didn't look that much well, it's kind of. A GM on her is different than a GM on me. I can get in the bag. That's what it looks like. <laughs> I know I got hips, but I, I think I can get in the bag. But this is the monogram with the Pevon interior. None of your business in that, huh? Not really. It's None not but <laughs> can I dig in here? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all which wallet she's got. I have a wallet. Oh, well, she has this little diggly daggly. It's a what is it? A four? Four. A four I mean, ring holder. Six. She needs a six. Y'all heard her say it. I didn't convince anyone. <laughs> if my brother-in-law watching, she said it, not me. She needs a six. So the four is about to be out the door. That's the only thing you have in here. My car holder. Where is it? In the pouch. Yeah, it's somewhere. It better be in there. Oh, goodness. Well, no, that's makeup. Hold on, y'all. Oh, look. I'm like, hold on now. See, it does look a little I know, because most people get on here and they be saying stuff, y'all. But I said, my sisters are Louis girls. I meant it. When I say stuff on here, <laughs> y'all can take it to the, take it to the court, because it's all right. I see over here. What, since 2007 we've been doing this? Is yeah. 16 years? I've been, I've been in You more than me, but you know, we both but do it. It's so okay. It way more than and our husbands love it, because they support it. <laughs> but that's what I wanted to show y'all. That's who was at the door. So if y'all aren't following her, what's your channel? Just Tiffany. And just Tiffany. No, so, he on the just, just Tiffany. So J-U-S Tiffany. Tiffany. That's my sister. That's I'm gonna open it next week. Well, for my birthday. What is that? Something that just came. I thought that was you at the door, but that was him. UPS. So oh, okay, no, this time for real, y'all. Thank y'all for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel or Tiffany's, come on. What y'all waiting on? Subscribe. You'll like it over here. We're still just starting out, but we're gradually getting there. Authentic as possible, as authentic as we can be. And Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, comment. Y'all know I talk back to everybody. Cause I talk and, and, and I'm the talker of the family. I talk to everybody. There's no stranger that I've met. Yeah, she's see. But like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, taking time out of your life to be here. And check back next week. Peace. Bye.